Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard. In today's video, we have an epic universe construction update. All these photos are going to be provided by Bio Reconstruct. So, thank you to him. Follow him on Twitter for some awesome aerial updates for multiple theme parks and on the East Coast and West Coast. But yeah, haven't done an epic universe construction update in a while, so I said it. Let's check it out because things are running rapidly over there for its projected opening in 2025. And maybe some lands will open up earlier than that in 2024 with a full opening in 2025. We'll have to see. But specifically, Super Nintendo World over there is rapidly progressing with lots of track for both the attractions or for Mario Kart and Yoshi. And just here, right here, is an overview of the track of the whole park. See all those cranes and a lot of steel structures being erected. So let's jump right in. Let's get it. Get right to it. All right. So first up here we have the classic Monsters Land, and this is where the main dark ride is going to be. Rumors have it to be a cougar ride system, just like Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey, but like an advanced or more upgraded version, making the seating a little bit more comfortable and less claustrophobic which would be awesome and potentially the benches will have spikes because you'll be going through Dracula's castle and this right here is the work the steel structure going up for that show building for Dracula's castle and the ride itself it's gonna be a massive ride and the classic monsters land itself will have two attractions this right here and the second attraction was supposed to be a show but new permit filing filings indicate it might be a coaster potentially a spinning coaster so we'll have to be watching that very closely can't see much happening on that section so we'll have to wait probably in the next update we'll see more footers for that and maybe even some track on site and we'll see what happened what's happening there but yeah the main work for the classic monsters land was again happening here in Dracula's castle then you'll be in just a European village, like kind of Dracula's village. And that'll be the whole land. I'm very curious about this land because it looks super immersive. Just again, not even the ride itself, but the land itself. Walking through the uh, European village in Dracula's homeland with Dracula's castle perched on top. It basically has almost like basically the risen world of Harry Potter, but themed to the classic monsters right because you have the village and you have a castle and you have the same ride system through a castle so it's almost like a reskin of harry potter or the risen world of harry potter um but obviously it won't be just it'll be much much different but just the basic structure seems just like that it's very interesting now that i think about it now we get to more vertical construction and a lot of you may know but this is the donkey kong attraction yes the donkey kong attraction is full steam ahead um one of the most developed if not the most developed attractions so far on in epic universe um in terms of construction again you have track pieces you have the storage track there those two you know vertical line those two vertical track pieces that'll be the real track and there'll be the false track it'll look like a minecart track up above and that all the white footage and stuff that's for the show building there'll be some show scenes it'll be it's an indoor outdoor coaster and yeah this is the maintenance bay for that um the donkey kong coaster and you can see even the little bit of the lift tiller breaking break run um right there and here again a close look at the donkey kong track down on either the lift hill or one of the drops but yeah that is that track piece and you will not be able to see that track piece because that'll be underground so to speak there'll be the fault the false track that minecart track is what you'll be seeing from and the guests will be seeing from the outside and the real track will be hidden so it looks like when you're jumping the gaps it looks like you're actually jumping um there'll be like nothing there it'll be quite thrilling which is super exciting cannot wait to see what this looks like in tokyo when it opens in 2024 and then in 2025 or maybe late 2024 here in epic universe be very excited for that and i'll definitely try to make my way to orlando so i can write that because it doesn't look like we're getting the donkey kong attraction here in hollywood unfortunately 
And here, another part of Super Nintendo World that we see is the Yoshi attraction. This is, um, you can see the formings of the station here. That big circle in the middle is the round turntable where the Omni Move, it's an Omni Mover system like the Haunted Mansion and Little Mermaid and Ride and Secret Life of Pets, just like that. So, um, that turntable is the load station, almost like Grizzly River Run or any type of rapids ride where guests will stand in the circle and they'll load on, they'll load and unload on different ve ride vehicles as they move slowly around the turntable and go along the track. And you can see the white footers for the track, those, those white things sticking up in the middle of the dirt. That is the Donkey Kong track. It will have two show scenes, one that will be right off the station and then one inside the pyramids as you can see in the POV at Universal Studios Japan and on the bottom you can see that little archway on the bottom is the entrance to the attraction and that black cylinder that is the entrance to the Toad's Cafe that um, obviously you can't there's nothing more of that that is left but or haven't has been built yet but that is the entrance to the Toad's Cafe and then Mount Bean Purple form above the Yoshi attraction but yeah it looks uh looks fantastic I mean they got a, again a lot of detail already forming on the main ride station the Yoshi ride isn't that long so they should they'll probably be getting that first there is track on site for the Yoshi like the Omnimover track it is on site so they should definitely be getting the footers in I'd say definitely by the end of the month and maybe even some of that track on on the footers uh, into August which Again, that's something Super Nintendo World is going so fast here. Um, probably because, again, it is they're just replicating it from Japan and now Hollywood. So the research and development is basically done. It's like a copy and paste from Japan's version, basically. So they don't really have to, it's not a prototype. So they can definitely, they know what they're doing. They can therefore build it fast. And they ordered, they already have the parts and stuff. Because they just ordered it three times, right, for Hollywood, Orlando, and Japan. So they can just erect it really fast. Also, they may have some contractual obligations for Nintendo, with Nintendo, to have it built and open by a certain time. Which may be the reason why they're working on that first and faster than the other lands. Um, it's probably a combination of all of those um, but yeah, so very interesting. But what do you guys think of this quick Universal Epic Universe update? If you like more, if you like this, I'll do more Epic Universe updates when they come. And I get more, more photos. Um, when the well, photos are posted on Twitter, and I'll analyze them. Um, Lance, uh, Lord, Epic Universe again is opening just in two and a half years, right? Twenty twenty five, not too, not too far in the future. It's coming up kind of fast. I love it. Very excited to see all the rides here. I'm very excited for the classic Monsters Land, How to Train Your Dragon, Wizarding World of Harry Potter, I'm sorry, Fantastic Beasts, and um, Super Nintendo World. What is your favorite land coming to Epic Universe? Which one are you most excited for? And are you are you surprised by how fast Super Nintendo World here in Orlando, or, yeah, in Orlando is moving along? And even the Epic Universe or classic monsters? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, have a fantastic day.